Got more uh, watches, warnings, advisories. Uh, we've got the red flag warning in effect again today, not for all of southeastern Arizona, but for parts of southeastern Arizona today. Cold front is on the way, but it's really not going to pass through until this afternoon. So we are dealing with the wind most of the day today. So red flag warning extends through most of New Mexico, western Texas, all the way up through Oklahoma and Kansas and Colorado, parts of Colorado. So let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit closer. We're kind of on the southwestern end of the main red flag warning, uh, but but here's a look at who's in effect for parts of Arizona. Of course, this includes most of Santa Cruz, most of Cochise, Graham and Greenlee County, and parts of Pinal and Pima County as well. But it won't go into effect until 11 a.m. through uh, up until, I should say, 7 p.m. tonight. So a very windy day today. There's also a high wind warning on the New Mexico side of the border and up towards the north where gusts could climb to about 65 miles per hour. But here in southeastern Arizona, gusts could climb to about 55 miles per hour, especially to the east of Tucson. So far Eastern Pima County, Santa Cruz County, and all of Cochise, Graham and Greenlee County are included in the wind advisory, and this will go from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. So sustained wind between 25 and 35 miles per hour, gusting about 45 to 55 miles per hour in those spots. And that's why blowing dust is going to be a concern again today. Just an advisory for now, but we could easily see blowing dust with wind like that, and that will also remain in effect from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. tonight. Current wind, 33 miles per hour gusting here in Tucson, close to 25 in Benson and in Sierra Vista. Definitely some pockets of gusts over 40 miles per hour already, and the wind will get a little bit worse before it gets better. But at least our temps are nice again, mainly in the 50s and 60s. But after this front rolls through, temperatures are going to get pretty cold tonight. It just depends on if we stay breezy overnight. And if we do keep the wind, temps won't drop as much. But if we have a calm wind, overnight lows are going to get pretty chilly. But high temps today, low to mid 70s, low 40s for the mountains. And then overnight tonight, a lot of us are dropping down to near freezing. A few of us below freezing like the mountains and colder valleys and Wilcox. So you're going to want to protect the four P's tonight just in case. And that includes, of course, people, pets, plants and pipes. That is a check of weather. Now let's go ahead and check out traffic this morning. And we're taking a look at your morning commute. And for your commute predictor, all these times are looking good for this time in the morning. Robbie.